think of engineering, but put in reverse. Reverse engineering is the process of taking apart an object to see how it works. Software, physical machines, military technology, and even biological functions related to how genes work are all able to be reverse engineered. Reverse engineering software requires many important tools to be able to properly reverse engineer. Reverse engineering is primarily used to replicate a product more inexpensively or because the original product is no longer available. It can also help improve your software quality. Learn how by clicking the link above or in the description below. There are generally three steps when reverse engineering. Information extraction, when the object or design is studied and the important information is extracted. Modeling, abstracting the collected information into a model. And review, testing the model to see if it has been successfully reverse engineered. Some common examples of what companies reverse engineer include software, like reconstructing the source code, which also requires the use of other tools like CAD and a disassembler. Computer parts. If a processor manufacturer wants to make its own processor based off a competitor's design. And network security assessments. Companies will reverse engineer network attacks to prevent them in the future. Reverse engineering has many legitimate uses in IT, and it's mostly legal. However, there are some laws that pertain to reverse engineering, including the patent law, copyright and fair use law, and the Electronic Communications Privacy Act, among others. The ethics behind reverse engineering can be complicated, and it's only compounded by the proliferation of information technology in everyday life. Does your company practice reverse engineering to improve? Let us know in the comment section below and be sure to hit that like button.